Hi everyone, this is Sifu Jeff with Organic Martial Arts School of Wing Chun Do Health, Wellness, and Healing. And today I'm going to go over a little bit more on the breath that I talked about and also adding to it as far as times and, and things to things to do with it. All right. So first of all, re, uh, quick review on that. All right. Making sure you're breathing from the center, from your belly. And I, what I do is I place my palms back to back, or palm to back, the palm right there, and place it directly over my center of my belly button. And I want to feel like my hands are actually pulling my stomach out, actually pulling the air into me that way. Do not pay attention to breathing there. Sometimes I've watched some people do it, and it's still a little subtle right there, and they don't realize they're doing it. So if you have a mirror that you can watch yourself, record yourself doing it for a moment, just just to see that you're getting you know better and better with it. Because um, you keep doing it, you can improve with it. I know it. I believe in you. All right, so placing the hands right there, inhaling through the nose, exhaling through the mouth, and taking your time with it. Uh, the more you do it, the longer, the deeper, the breath you get, the better. All right, so don't compare yourself to anything. Just make sure you're doing better than you were the next day. And speaking of that, some days are not going to be as great as others. But show up. Do it. It'll keep going. It'll improve. So, one thing I want to talk about is setting intentions. And these are certain things uh, that you want to change about yourself. Things you want to improve. Things you want to get rid of. So, the best time to really do that naturally, organically, is when you first wake up. And when you're just as you're falling asleep. Uh, what it is, is the subconscious and conscious are closest together at that time. And that's when the best trans... Uh, transformation transition of energy can happen okay that's when you can best trans that is when you can best transfer energy all right so with that you want to try and do it at those times also if you're gonna do it throughout the midday if you if you're a nap person you take a nap in the middle of the day that's a great time too but if you do have the time to do it what you want to do is sit in a comfortable quiet place sit and relax, do the breathing, and get closer to a relaxed low, a relaxed uh, to a close state of sleep. All right? So in that point, that's when you can go ahead and, and set your intentions. And I'm talking about, you don't want a direct, direct answer as far as, I want a million dollars tomorrow. Yeah. What I'm talking about is, and we call it setting into the unknown. I want to be a multimillionaire. I am a multimillionaire. Saying that I am a multimillionaire, I understand I am a multimillionaire. Sending those things in. I am taking the actions to become a multimillionaire. I am taking the actions to go to the gym. I am taking the actions to do a good workout. I'm taking the actions to eat healthier, to do better in my life, to make better choices. Certain things. I always, I always try to include that you are thankful and that you are healed as well but definitely thankful for that. So getting that state, getting those subconscious and conscious closer to transition that those messages and everything to set them in your subconscious, it's going to, you know, takes a few times when it starts to, to set in. Now here's something throughout the day as far as catching yourself, not, you know, breathing from the chest or, or starting to react a certain way. You got to catch yourself. You got to make yourself accountable to you to not react in those fashions. And then stop and wait a moment and, and do, do some breaths and relax and reapproach the situation. If you're getting into an argument with someone, you may have to right there regulate and relax. All right? To be honest, most arguments are BS and you ain't got shit to prove to anybody, so you do you, okay? Thank you. All right. So uh, that was a little bit of information today. I'll be putting out more tomorrow, uh, more the next few days. That was a little information today. I'll be putting out more in the next few days. I have another form of meditation coming to you as well. And these are really good to do on the spot or and they take a couple minutes. You don't have to meditate for hours at a time or half hour, 20 minutes. If you're getting to that point, that's awesome. You know? Uh, but one thing also saying on these intentions, again, sometimes my train of thought, everybody, you're only human. Your, train, your thought starts to drift off. Pull yourself back. Oh, I got to do this. Oh, wait, no. We're meditating. We're here. You know, you want to be relaxed, but sometimes you get too relaxed and your thoughts start drifting this way. So what's going on, real quick here, 
this is the direction you want to go. This is your brain, this is your body. And right now they're both going this way. So that when you meditate, it starts pulling your brain in this direction. Well, your body has a memory too, and your body has a memory of going this way. So right now you gotta stay strong in the mind and then start the body will start pulling and you both start aligning. The thoughts and emotions that you're using are an energy. When it become when you're doing an action or something it becomes a matter. You want to stay in the energetic state. Saying these intentions, breathing, connecting into your heart as you're doing it, and putting emotion to it, feeling it, creating it for yourself like it's actually there, like it's actually accomplished and done. You are in that moment. You are in your hundred million dollar house. You're you're driving your new car. You're in your great relationship. You have your businesses are doing wonderful. Be in that state like you are already there. Thanks again. I'm Sifu Jeff with Organic Martial Arts School of Wing Chun Do, Health, Wellness, and Healing. Have a great day.